Hello Taurus, welcome to your love reading. This is going to be reading all about your person, what they're secretly thinking or feeling about you. We're going to be looking at obviously what they're thinking or feeling and also their true intentions and what actions they're going to take next when it comes to this connection. This will be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus and it'll be for those of you who are already in some sort of a connection or have a connection in mind. All right, so let's see, let's see. Let's start with what they're secretly thinking or feeling at this time. Messages for Taurus, please. What are their person thinking or feeling regarding this connection? What are they secretly thinking or feeling regarding this connection for Taurus? What are they secretly thinking or feeling? Okay, we got judgment. This is all about kind of evaluating the past, learning from your mistakes, having some sort of awakening, a second chance, a rebirth. We'll see when I clarify. Oh, and then we got the world reverse. Unfinished business, lack of closure, maybe a chapter hasn't fully closed here. Um, there could be unfinished business between you. Have the high priestess at the bottom. So let's see. What else can you tell me about what this person is thinking or feeling regarding Aquarius. If I could shuffle, that would be great. For, did I say Aquarius? I'm talking about Taurus. I hope I said Taurus, but Aquarius and Taurus kind of rhyme. Okay, for Taurus. What are their person thinking or feeling regarding this connection with Taurus? Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> unfinished symphony. So definitely there's some unfinished business here, Taurus, between you and this person. Exchanging gifts at the bottom. I feel like there's some sort of um, communication or exchange that has to happen here. Um, maybe the other person is wondering if the, you know, one of you is wondering if the other one feels the same, if there is still something here. Let's see. Tell me more regarding the person that Taurus is dealing with spirit. Help me clarify these energies for Taurus. Tell me about judgment. Page of Pentacles. Some sort of offer. They want to talk to you about something here. Or they want to have a new opportunity. Judgment again. What are the odds? <laughs> yeah, this person cares about you, Taurus. Whoever this is, they have a lot of love for you. They want a second chance with you. Tell me about, move this over, can you see? Tell me about the world reverse. Eight of Wands, Reverse. Tell me more about the world, Reverse. It's like things are at a standstill. Someone no longer wants to fight. They 
They want to overcome the conflict. Knight of Cups reverse. It's almost like they, they didn't tell you what they should have told you. Um, maybe the communication has been blocked or they just didn't say what they should have said when they had the time or the chance. Lovers at the bottom of the deck. Gemini energy. This person just wants the fighting to be over, so they might just say what they need to say here with the Knight of Cups reverse. But I have a feeling it's almost like for them, it's like they don't want this chapter to close or... They want to move things forward, whatever is at a standstill. What else can you tell me about what this person is secretly thinking or feeling about Taurus? What else can you tell me about what this person is thinking or feeling about Taurus? Spirit? Yeah, Oyster. They're clammed up about something. They need to tell you something here. What else can you tell me about? How this person's thinking or feeling. That's way too many. About Taurus. Yeah, again, a lot of emotions here, a lot of um depth to this person. Um I really feel like this is something that they've hidden deep down. They're loyal to you. They they want to provide for you, give you something. Um, very hardworking, the beaver. Very serious as well. They don't play around. I'm going to be using my new um, deck. It's in work. It's under construction. <laughs> my Secret Moon Oracle deck. Um, this is just a sample. The deck is much larger, but I want to start using it because I really, really like it. So... What else do we need to know for Taurus? How is this person thinking or feeling about Taurus spirit? Okay, we got please forgive me. What else can you tell me? I'm ready to open up. <laughs> Well, they need to with that oyster. Bottom of the deck, I don't have the courage. So that could be the hold up here. Um, your person is probably just scared to tell you what they truly feel about you here. Um, perhaps communication has been blocked. So your person, in their mind, they have no chance with you whatsoever here. So let's look at their true intentions. Tell me about this person's true intentions towards Taurus, please. Tell me about their true intentions towards Taurus. What their true intentions? Okay, we got the Nine of Pentacles. And the Three of Cups. What's this? I want to come out. Chariot. Hmm. It's like they want to reunite with you. And they want to appear stable, grounded, successful to you. Tell me more about this Nine of Pentacles. This is Nine of Pentacles here. Devil Reverse. So they've broken free of something and are now uh, in, uh, free, independent, 
Tell me more about the Nine of Pentacles, please. You're no longer stuck or affected or attached to something. Yeah, Two of Cups. Wow. They want to come together with you. These two cards are about coming together. Exchanging Cups. You know, it's, it's like, please forgive me so that we can be together again. You know, please forgive me so that we can have a shot again. I'm, I'm free of whatever it was that was holding me back. This could be fear. You know, I have seven of wands at the bottom. So it's like they want to fight for this. Fight for your attention, for your love. Tell me about the three of cups. Queen of Wands, a lot of passion, attraction. This person's very attracted to you, motivated to come towards you. Remember the chariot came out. Tell me more about this Three of Cups. Ace of Cups reverse. Nine of Swords. It's like almost like they're worried about whatever was heartbreaking or disappointing between you. They're fearful that you're going to reject their cup. Can I get one more for this three of cups? The Hermit reverse Virgo energy. Interesting. Maybe this person um, is avoiding having this discussion or trying to avoid a certain situation because they're worried. Four of Wands at the bottom. Maybe this person ran away from commitment. Maybe this person left a stable commitment with you or with someone else. They could be taking way too long to figure this out. But this is their intention is to come together. So what are their next actions going to be? Tell me about this person's next actions towards Taurus, please. What are their next actions going to be? Towards Taurus, please. Knight of Swords, yeah, coming in hot. Very quickly, maybe unexpectedly for some of you. What are their next actions going to be? Oh, but then I got the page of wands reverse. Queen of Swords. You might have blocked this person. Tell me more about the Knight of Swords. Let's start there. Tell me more about the Knight of Swords, please. For Taurus. Eight of Wands reverse. Tell me more about the Knight of Swords, please. Eight of Swords reverse, Nine of Cups. So it's like, um, it's like this person was not communicating, was trapped in their fear, and then they like broke free of that and are like just coming straight towards you here. Whatever interference there was in this person's life is no longer there, I feel. I have the Three of Cups reversed at the bottom there, so. Tell me about this Page of Wands reverse. Page of Wands reverse. 
high priestess reversed. Yeah, it's almost like um, this. That's that I'm ready to open up. Tell me more about this page of wands reverse. Hangman reverse. Wow, major arcana's here like crazy. Okay, what else? What else can you tell me? The sun reverse. This was like hidden from you. This is a, a secret coming to light. Um, this is someone wanting to speak after silence with the high priestess reverse. Um, possibly something that was a secret is being now revealed. With the page of wands reverse, this could be like a blocked or delayed message. Or it could be that um, this person might not follow through or their fear might get the best of them. Um, or you might just block this person. Like you might not be open to this, this, this message from this person. I feel like this is someone who had hidden their feelings for, for, for a while or for a reason. I don't know. There, the, the sun reverse, something here was blocked or, or hidden. And then I have the hangman reverse. Hangman reverse is usually someone that is like stubborn, doesn't want to let go. doesn't want to sacrifice it's almost like your person doesn't want to be the one that like goes out on a limb and makes the first move you know tell me more about this page of wands reverse <laughs> knight of pentacles reverse that was what, that's what it was at the bottom so this is very slow delays, 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 obstacles. But I feel like these obstacles are the ones that your person has put in their own path. Three of cups reverse. Again, some, some sort of interference here is causing delays. That could be another person. That could be the fear. That could be um, finances, career, distance, family. What's this nine of cups? What is your person's wish? What's this nine of cups about? Wow. Well, whatever this nine of cups is about, I feel like it's going to come about because the tower happens or going after their wish fulfillment this person that you're dealing with is going to cause a tower here <clears throat> with the lovers reverse there could be a separation that your person goes through or it's like um a different choice that they make here i feel like this this is you like this is you going after you is going to be unexpected or cause a tower um making a different decision here. Maybe it's not expected for your person to do that. Death reverse. This person doesn't, yeah. This person does not want things to be completely over between you. Um, they want to talk to you, ask for forgiveness, open up, tell you that you are their wish, that they want something to happen with you. Despite the interferences that this person is dealing with, I feel like the choice has already been made or your person, that's their next actions is to make this choice. I want to clarify judgment over here before I wrap this up. Hold on, let me... Spirit, tell me about judgment. Let me clarify judgment. I 
Let me clarify judgment, please. What's judgment about? I feel like this is what your person is currently experiencing. Is some sort of awakening here. Yeah, there's an ending that your person, they're ending a cycle here, or they want to restart something that had already ended. Have a second chance or rebirth. Temperance reverse, Sagittarius energy. Something has not come together for your person. More time is needed. Um, perhaps perhaps your person's becoming a little impatient, or it's just it, this needs a little bit more work for it to come together in harmony. Knight of Wands, yeah. So this awakening is something that your person wants, and there's a Queen of Cups at the bottom. So that tells me it's like this person's motivated by their emotions, their intuition, how they feel about you. You could be dealing with a fire sign, an earth sign, a water sign. I also have a strong Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini. Here. Uh, thank you so much for watching, for your likes, shares, and subscribes. If you want to support the channel for free, please hit the like button and subscribe. It helps the channel grow and I appreciate your support. Um, thank you so much to everyone who has uh, supported the channel thus far. And I'll leave it here, Taurus. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in another video. Take care.